हेलो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स माय सेल्फ पूर्णिमा अंगड़ी लेक्चरर एट सी एल एज डिग्री कॉलेज चिकोड़ी सो आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड यू आर इन द थर्ड सेमेस्टर नाउ सो फॉर यू पीपल आई विल बी हैंडलिंग द सब्जेक्ट कंप्यूटर एप्लीकेशन टू सो बिफोर मूविंग टू द पर्टिकुलर चैप्टर I would like to give some information regarding your syllabus. Okay, so the first chapter will be introduction to MS Excel. So in your previous semester, you have learned regarding MS Word as well as MS PowerPoint, right? So in this semester, you will be going to learn one of the package of ms office that is ms excel in this video you will only learn some of the introduction part so what is exactly ms excel is what are the features of ms excel and for what purpose we should use ms excel in our day to day life so here you will be learning advantages of ms excel and how to open a ms excel window and what are the different types of ms excel window and you will be going to learn some of the basic terms regarding what is spreadsheet and what are the different parts of spreadsheet like rows column what is active cell in that and what are exactly cell address and cell pointer and cell references right and moving to that chapter we will be learning how to open a workbook how to close a workbook and how to save a workbook we will be learning that one and next how to insert a data and how to alter a data and how to delete a data in a particular worksheet right and also we will be going to learn how to do the autofill option option and some of the data formattings and how to use the formula in ms excel as ms excel is mainly based on the numerical analysis of your data and also you will be going to learn how to ascend ascending your information how to descending your information like sorting technique you are going to learn and in last you will be learning some references the different types of references like what are absolute relative and mixed references only you are going to learn the introduction the some basic part in this particular chapter so moving to the second chapter that is working with ms excel so in this particular chapter you are exactly work with the ms excel what are functions in ms excel there are several inbuilt functions we are going to use them and what are the different types of those functions some advantages as well as disadvantages of those function will be learning in the second chapter that is working with ms excel and also here we are uh, we are going to learn what are charts graphs as well as macros how to create a chart based on the particular data what are the different parts or components of chart how to create a macro how to run a macro and how to delete a macro and some of its advantages and disadvantages we are going to learn and also we are going to learn how to do the data sorting data validation data consolidation in the particular chapter that is second chapter so moving to the third chapter that is dbms database management system here we will be learning what is exactly data means what is information what is database and what is database management system and also evolution of database system we are learning here 
and some of the file oriented database management system how the data will be processed how the data will be moved in a particular organization and the data processing model we are learning in the dbms chapter and some of the conceptual database systems and the relation or relative database management system will be learning in the third chapter so moving to the fourth chapter that is ms access it is also one of the application of the ms office package here we will be learning what is data what is information what is the exactly difference between data as well as the information here we will be learning how to open a ms access window what are the different parts of ms access window and here we will be learning how to create a form how to create a report how to do the query and we will be learning what how to create a tables what are fields so many things we'll be learning in ms access so moving to the last chapter that is management information system here we'll be learning what is data what are the sources of data how to process the data what exactly the data will be moving in a particular organization what is the in importance of data processing in a particular organization and lastly what is the exact role or responsibility of a system analyst in a particular organization while handling the particular data so these are the five chapter we will be learning in our third semester and as for your guide as for your question paper you will be having 80 marks for your external as well as 20 marks for your internal so will be having your case study question on the ms access right so in the next in our uh, upcoming classes we will start with our chapters i hope you understood the syllabus thank you stay home stay safe